political campaigns have been on the high note in the last few months, with politicians crisscrossing the country in search of votes. With it, money has been used on this new front of campaigns, border border riders. This is one of the key targets of many politicians and has been used to cause and perpetrate violence in many areas across the country, especially during elections. The national government through the Ministry of Interior is warning that perpetrators of violence during the next year polls will not be spared while urging the riders to be agents of peace in this season. Because of that, then it is a sector that we in the security sector must pay attention to because it is interacting with millions and millions of people providing that convenience uh, whether it is carrying people, whether it is transporting uh, parcels, uh, luggage, you are interacting with people every day. Kobia has indicated that Kenya has been experiencing voter bribery cases, hate speech and intimidation every election cycle, vices that will be halted in the next elections. Simungependa jina lenu liwe ni jina likisikika kwamba watu wajue kwamba tunasukumuza mambo ya amani na mambo ya tumaini si ndio kwa hivyo ninyi kama vile tumesema kutoka wakati huu ni ninyi mtakuwa peace ambassadors wetu sio NCC peke yake lakini Kenya mzima that is why we are here today it is because of this peace symposium that it becomes so critical and so important kwa sababu Nini mboda mboda mbebeba nguvu za kuinua ama kuangusha inchi yetu. Kwa hivyo is upon you. Mungependa inchi yetu inuke au inchi yetu iende chini. The government has been at the forefront in urging Kenyans to hold peaceful elections as election draw high. With only eight months remaining for the general election, the NCIC, in conjunction with the Boda Boda Association, has urged Kenyans to make sure that they help in conducting peaceful election come the year 2022. Reporting for Switch TV, my name is Damris Nyambura.